G'day you beautiful people, my name is Lucas and today we're going to find out which cartoon character is the richest. Unfortunately, no Bob shout out today. If you don't know Bob, he is this beautiful stick figure fella. I hide him in every one of my videos. If you find him, you get a shout out in the next one. It's really that simple, so don't forget to look for him if you want that elusive shout out. But enough of that, let's get straight to our video. Okay, here we are. Let's find out who the richest characters are. Starting off with Plankton. And then Eric Carmen, both of them in severe debt. Like, an unbelievable, well, Plankton, over a million debt. Well, does make sense. And, yeah, Cartman makes sense too, let's be honest. He's a bit of a cheeky fella, let's just say that. Brian, I guess he's not the most financially responsible person. So it would make sense, you know, going to, going to death, and he's a dog, so. Pocahontas, well, I'm going to, I'll move my head over here, so then you can see, there. Pocahontas, zero, again, makes sense. You know, being at a time, like the, like the film is set at a time, you know, her people didn't use, like, money, so, so yeah, makes sense. <laughs> Again, not really the most financial, financially responsible person out there. And he kind of lost all his money by accident. Milan. Only 10k. But honestly, only 18 grand. I would have expected more. I guess it's not. it might not be going off just assets maybe. Who knows. I mean, running a business could put him into debt, I guess. Uh, Tiana, I'm surprised it's that low, but interesting. Let's keep going. Snow White, that has to be decent. For uh, I guess she's only a princess, isn't she? Grunkle Stan, over 100 grand. Post mortgage, 168,189. 100, Honestly, I was expecting... Uh, him to have less. I was ex I would have expected Jerry to have le Jerry to have less to be honest. Peter Griffin, surely Peter doesn't have that much. Oh, actually, I was gonna say like with his shenanigans, he would have lost so much money. Same with Homer, but I mean they've had some endeavors where they've made money in some episodes, so I guess it must even out. Let's continue, Hank. Richest out of these three. Stan Smith has to have a decent amount, you know. Honestly, I could I could expect more, but I guess he's had a lot of shenanigans that w would cost money to, like, do. Like, he's a good, big CIA. He's a decent CIA agent. That'd pay, that'd pay nice, you know, da being a dangerous job and all. And, yeah, he has a nice house. Looks like he, he acts like he'd have a decent amount of money, so not, not a surprise that he has a decent net worth. SpongeBob. I mean, K okay, does work a long week. Uh, at the end of the series, it does make sense that Mr. Garrison would have a decent amount of money. Uh, Cinderella's evil stepmom. Honestly, surprised. Never really think about her in as in like rich money, but I guess she would have got um, Cinderella's dad's money too, and then she probably came for money as well. Let's continue. Merida, Merida, I guess she is like nobility. Cru I was gonna, I was gonna say a bit surprising with Krusty, but he's an entertainer. He's a children's entertainer. Entertainer. He's an. He does acting. He has. He owns his own show. He would be making bank, so it makes sense. Corella probably rich. Yep, six mil. Mr. Krabs. Okay, ha what? Oh yeah, is that that's a lot of it would have to be given to him by his dad. But nine point four mil, I was not expecting to see Stan this high on the list. And same with Mister Krabs, but I guess you know he's a businessman do that doesn't spend much money. Stan, 
Okay, 9.4 mil for Stan, though. I was not... I. It's been, like, partway through last year was the last time I rewatched the series, so... It's been a bit. It was end of, It was a cup. Yeah, but... Hmm. I was not expecting Stan to be 9.4 mil this high. Rapunzel. Bojack makes... Oh, honestly, depends where in his career we're going. At the end of the series, he well, would he have had that much at the end of the series? Because he was having some financial problems during it. Some legal issues, you know. Um, nah, I guess. Have, mm, I would have, like, depending what time they're going, that, that they're taking that from. But Rapunzel makes sense, especially at the end, you know. Again, nobility. And, well, Bojack, actor, and he came, he, well, he started acting again towards the end, but honestly, I would have expected less. About 40 mil. That must have been after the marriage. 42 mil for Cinderella. 70 mil. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of shocked Bell would be at 40 mil, but I guess, you know, consolidating wealth with Beast, but again, that 40, oh, I, I'm surprised he would be worth 40 mil, cause, but I mean, if they go off assets, the cast would be worth a lot. And a lot of the artwork. Yeah. I don't, do for spurts? Is it like, okay, Evil Queen. Half a bill, 500 mil. Did not expect the Evil Queen, but... I was, this one threw me off a lot more. Doofensmirtz at 292 mil. It's been a while since I've watched Phineas and Ferb, I, I have to be honest, but I was not expecting that. Aurora, so let's Sleeping Beauty, isn't it? Yeah, I think. No, that's it, not Sleeping Beauty, the other one. Yeah, the other one falls asleep. Why can't I remember her name? What's what's a tail? One with a pinwheel, isn't it? Why can't I remember? But Mr. Monopoly. I didn't I wasn't I wouldn't have expected him to count as like a cartoon character, you know? But he would be worth a lot. Oh, I I'm, I'm still caught up, I can't remember it's a it's the one Maleficent's based off as well. What's that called? It's a, I I can't remember. I'm drawing a blank. Who knows? I'll see if I remember during it. One point two, another one point two bill. Mister Burns surely is worth a lot. Honestly, could have expected a little bit more. Ooh, far richer brother is one. I oh yeah, I kind of remember he, the episodes that he, he's in. The, at least one episode he's in. But I wasn't expecting that much money. Mr. Burns, I was expecting to be well up the list. Let's see who... I reckon Scrooge McDuck has to be number one, though. I'm predicting it now. If they use the calcs by, you know... Was it film they used, Yeah, Film Theory would have done it. Megamind, 1.6. Love a bit of Megamind. Thomas the Tank Engine! <laughs> we love Thomas. Uh, I wasn't expecting him to be Two point two bill though, and I wasn't. I was not expecting to see him. Gomez Adams, yeah, he's rich. We a lot of people know that. One five. We're getting into some big money. Bender, he's worth. I was not expecting to see Bender. I was not expecting to see that. Richie Rich, expectable. Oh Carter, yeah. Over seven bill for Carter was I, I was pretty much expecting that to be pretty high. We've still got a decent a bit to go. Let's see. Syndrome, yeah, he would be rich, you know. Weapons dealing, honestly, I was expecting Mum to be higher. I was expecting her to be a bit higher than that, but yeah, given you know so far in the future, 
Inflation would have been insane. I, I was thinking her net worth would be way higher than 15.7 bill, but I, 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 the, the small details about money is something I'm not going to remember while well watching Futurama. Another show I, I rewatched last year, actually. Love a bit of Futurama. Syndrome of expecting to be high, you know. Weapons dealing is quite a lucrative industry. Let's continue. Jasmine would be worth a lot, being, you know, nobility. 51. Scrooge McDuck, 65.4 bill. Do, do we reckon there's going to be more? There's a tiny bit left in the video, but it could be outro. I called it. I called it. Scrooge McDuck is number one. I, I know my um, cartoons. That's what I know. I know my cartoons. Scrooge McDuck, and it's not because um, Film Theory did a video on it ages ago, and they predicted him to have an insane net worth. I can't remember exact. I just knew it was really high. So, honestly... I'm surprised it's only at 65, 65.4 bill. I thought it could have been higher, but I haven't watched the video on it in quite some time. But I predicted it. You guys all saw that. I, I, I am the king of predictions. I know my cartoons. I am a master of pop culture. And I just have to remind you, uh, Bob was hidden somewhere in that video. Did you find him? Did you win that elusive shout out? If you found him, don't forget to tell me so you can claim your precious shout out and... While you're at it, maybe like this video, maybe subscribe, or just and or just give me a random comment, like you know, say the word fish or saying I don't know. I just want. Uh, and other than that, I love you all and have a great day.